welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a home decor haul. As you guys know, I just moved into a new place, so I've just been picking up some random stuff here and there, so I want to share with you guys what I've picked up recently. Most of the stuff that I have is kitchen stuff, but I also got some other random stuff too. I found this really cool little Japanese place that's right by my mom's house. It's just really cool, unique items. I cannot remember the name of the store, but I'm going to insert a picture of it here. I took a picture of the outside because I wanted to share it with you guys because it's in Costa Mesa and it's just the coolest place. Everything's $1.50 unless it's marked for a different price. So a lot of the stuff that's in this haul is from that place. I also went to World Market and I think I got some stuff at Target that I'm going to put in this haul too. But yeah, so let's get into the first items. First off, I got these glasses for $1.50. They just have this really cool little blue marking through it and I just thought that they were really unique and I've never really seen glasses like this anywhere else. And because they were such a good price, I just could not say no to them. And I kind of want to go back and pick up like at least two more so that I have a set of six. I got these bowls as well. I love the little stand at the bottom of the bowls like that. And I love the markings in the inside. I'm just in love with this blue color recently. It's like a very like soft, dark blue, if that makes any sense. But I just love everything that's like got that like oriental floral feel to it. I always like to find really cool and unique like teacups and coffee mugs and stuff so when I saw these I was like these are $1.50 and they're so unique. There's just I just haven't seen anything like this. I really liked this one especially for tea. I love the floral print on this and I love love the colors of it and I really liked this one as well. I like this little detail on the side here, the two stripes and then the circle and then this rectangle and just the colors I think are gorgeous. I only got one of each because I really like mixing up my plateware. I don't necessarily feel like they all need to be matching. That kind of stresses my mom out a lot. Like my mom will be like, you need to get the full set if you're going to buy them. She wants me to buy like six of each and I'm like, no, I kind of like to just have all different random plates and cups and bowls. That might stress other people out, but I really like to have just like a mix of a bunch of random. My favorite part of the day is having a cup of coffee and I was doing it pretty basic. I was using the Keurig and just having my cup of coffee that way and I love coffee so much that I was like, why am I making really good coffee at home? So I recently got a grinder and a French press and I have been making some pretty good cups of coffee that I can actually taste the coffee. And um, so I'm really, really enjoying that. So I just got this little creamer holder, which I love, especially if you're having people over and I love my favorite part of the day. My favorite thing to cook is breakfast. And so I just really like having a little creamer like this. When you have people over and you're like making coffee for them and you just put like a little bit of like French vanilla cream in here and put it on the table, I just think it's so, so cute. Because I have been obsessed with coffee mugs recently, I got this mug from World Market and I just think it's gorgeous. I love the colors in it. The yellow in this mug is my favorite part about it. I just think it's a really pretty, bright, happy yellow color. So I've been using a lot of olive oil and balsamic vinaigrette and I keep it out because I use it so often. And so I saw this glass container at World Market and it's for olive oil and I just thought it was so pretty to put in the kitchen because I have an old-fashioned oven it's like a 1950s oven I think there's a shelf on my oven which I love and I just put like basil up there seasonings or like random decor and I think that this just looks so pretty on top of the oven and it's convenient I mean the top here is perfect for pouring the olive oil because I had a tendency to pour too much olive oil because the containers that you buy at the grocery store are like a little thick at the top so I would like dump too much in and then it would be just too oily but this little part at the top here makes it so it comes out perfectly so I just really thought that this was really pretty and super convenient to keep in the kitchen. This is pretty random but I did get this ice tray. It's got huge spots for ice so you can get like these big ice cubes which I think is really cool for like a smaller glass of either water or like even if you wanted to put ice in your wine or if you wanted 
to put I know like people put big pieces of ice in like gin not that I drink gin but um, I know that that's a thing I think it's gin no I think it's whiskey I think it's whiskey I don't know I don't drink gin or whiskey so I don't really know because when I walk into my house I just throw my keys in my purse wherever the heck I want to and I always cannot find my keys or my purse when I'm leaving the house. I bought these little key and purse hangers is what I'm calling them. I don't even know if that's what they're for, but they look, they seem like they are. I bought these at World Market and I'm just going to hang them by my front door so that when I get home, I can just throw my purse on one of them and my keys on the other. And I just think that they just have really cool patterns on them. I love the colors. Um, orangey green colors is kind of the theme of my place right now. I have two drawers in my kitchen that separate the sink and both of them had really old ugly knobs on them that actually kept coming off. At World Market I found these cool little knobs. This is one of them. The other one's like a greeny orangey color. I just decided to get two different ones. I like things to not match. I think I do that a lot in my clothes too. It's like I just don't really believe in matching perfectly all the time. I like mixing and matching things up. That's it for my home decor haul right now. There's going to be so much more videos like this because I haven't even gotten all my furniture yet. I'm really excited to have you guys join me in decorating my place. I'm gonna be doing some videos outside of the apartment where I'm like going and looking at things because I want you guys to be like part of the journey here because this is like my first place on my own so it's really exciting to just kind of make it exactly the way I want to and make it my own. So I'm really excited for you guys to kind of see all that come together. I'm going to let you guys go now. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. As always, I love you tons and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Make sure you guys check out my last video. It is a day to night look and make sure you're subscribed to my channel so that you guys can see when I have a new video coming out. and. Also, make sure to keep up with me on Twitter and Instagram. In the meantime, my Twitter's at Carrie underscore Rad, and my Instagram is Carrie Rad. I love you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.